Hello everybody, I am Jedi Jack Penguin and welcome back to my countdown to Christmas. Today I have another LEGO seasonal review. Today we're going to be looking at set number 854050, Snowman and Reindeer Duo. This set includes 126 pieces and retails for $9.99 where I got it at my local LEGO store. This set, just like a lot of the other Christmas related items that I've been reviewing over the past few weeks, all released back in October of this year 2020. So getting right into this and taking a look at the box are we have a different type of box for this particular set sort of similar to the other version of this set that we saw this year as well that being the pumpkin and bat Halloween ornament so just taking a look at the overall box design from the very front we do get this very nice Christmas tree look which we also get from the back but without these ornaments from the front these are the two builds that we get for this set from the sides you can also see that we get some tape right here in addition to some sparkling right there with the dark red I think that the box for this looks really nice and then like I said we do get the tree from the very top top features your Lego logo as well as this string that features this little tack just showing the piece count for this particular set as well as your ornaments choking hazard and then from within you get the choking hazard yet again in various different languages as well as your lego.com advertisement and then from the very back you do get the barcode for this particular product as well as the set number at the top so yeah that's pretty much all that I have to say for the box nothing really too exciting from the bottom other than the Lego trademarks right there so yeah let's open this up and see the box contents. So within the box we have one unnumbered bag right there, a different type of bag than our normal Lego bags right there, in addition to two of these strings for the ornament holders, and of course two instructions, one for each build, and our stickers, let's take a look at them. Here are the stickers included for this particular set. I did want to talk about like the thickness of this sticker sheet right here. It is a little bit of a different type of paper being used for the sticker. I'm not sure what material it's made of, but it's like a different type of thickness than our normal Lego stickers that we get. So that's just one thing that I did want to talk about right there for this. For our first instruction manual, we have one for our reindeer build right here. We just build it from the front and the very back of the instructions. Same thing goes for the snowman instructions, building from the front and then building from the back. No advertisements for either of these instructions. So let's take a look at the final overall models. So taking a look at the final overall model for both the snowman and reindeer ornaments right here. I think they turned out very nice. You know, the stickers, I'm not really too much of a fan of, and I'll show those up close when we look at these individually. So we might as well start with the snowman before we get to the reindeer. We of course have to get that cone piece in orange for the nose of the snowman that's connected using a jumper plate right from the front. We get three stickers for this character right here where we have one on this larger slope piece from the bottom for the mouth. And then two on these smaller slope pieces one by two for the eyes. I did want to complain that the colors of these stickers, you know, they're a little bit brighter than Lego's color for the pieces, which is one thing that I did have to minorly complain about when it actually comes to looking at these. You know, you might remember earlier on in the video, I did mention that the stickers are like a different kind of paper quality for this, which I find rather odd and it did peel rather differently compared to other Lego stickers that I'm used to. So that's just one thing that I did want to point out for this particular set if you're looking for something that has you know good quality I don't think the stickers for these are that great you know just because like the colors don't really match you know they should have used like the clear stickers but then yet again I don't like those either when it comes to the rest of the build we do just overall give us a bunch more of these slope pieces which you know I'm not complaining about that you know it's fine to get a bunch more of those but it just rounds out the build from the very bottom, we do get like what would be the remains of a scarf for this snowman. Just a 4x4 plate piece inside that red color. From the very top, we get a very nice top hat, which we do get an axle that runs through this just so then this area can actually hang, which, you know, can bounce this around. It's an ornament right there. You get one of these string pieces, which you do have to tie up at the very top. When it comes to Lego and these strings, I'm not really too much of a fan, but, you know, it's, it's good. It's a nice ornament, you know, just... Like I said, the sticker quality could have been a little bit better for this. You know, it's a, it's a decent build. That's really all that I have to say. But it's definitely something that I will end up putting up on my tree along with the other one. And then finally taking a look at the reindeer build. This one I actually like a little bit more though still we have that problem where the stickers are like a darker color compared to the piece. Compared to the other one we also do get more stickers right here. We have two on each side for these slope pieces just to round out the mouth. These one by two cheese slope pieces. We have one on this one by two tile piece from the very front for the mouth. 
We also have another jumper plate for the nose, which uses a dark gray stud for the front of that. And then we also do get the stickers from the front for the eyes on those 2x2 two two slope pieces. Just like the other one, we do round out the overall model going on from all the sides over here using the same piece that we use for the eyes from the top, which you know I don't have to complain about because I do really like getting those in that color. When it comes to the very top, we do have like the same technique being used to make sure that this string actually attaches and that it makes it easy so you can bounce it around. It's an ornament, like I said. But compared to the snowman, instead of getting the top hat, we have a different type of situation right here where we get these small little ears which are represented using these one by two slope pieces and then we also do get a little bit of hair from the very top in addition to these small little antlers which they also do use this piece inside that tan color which I do really like seeing that in this set as well but otherwise you know just the same type of build building on the side for both of these builds sticker quality isn't that great and that's really all that I have to say for these two so overall is this worth ten dollars I mean I think if you're an ornament collector, this is something that would be very nice to have some more Lego ornaments in your collection. They did release a similar set back in September, which was a Halloween themed ornament set with a pumpkin and a bat. You know, that would probably complete this set for this. Don't know if Lego's going to do any more of these for other holidays in the future. Would be very interesting to see that. But overall, like I said, sticker quality for these, not that great. Build quality is okay. You do get some very nice pieces overall for both of these builds. You know, definitely something that I would part out if I wasn't going to put these on my Christmas tree. So yeah, that's pretty much all that I have to say for this video. Leave your thoughts down in the comment section below what your thoughts are on this set. Also remember to like and subscribe and hit that bell icon so every time I upload a new video. So yeah, that's it for now and I will see you next time. Bye!